If you guys need your badges maxed out fast and legit, hit up Star Grinders on Twitter or Instagram and tell them JR sent you. Their links will be in the description down below. Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy JR. Y'all boys know I'm back with another banger. And in this video, I have another fire NBA 2K21 VC glitch. Now, with this glitch, I showed you guys how to do this in yesterday's video with the mod pack. I'm not gonna lie. With the mod pack, this VC glitch becomes even more OP. You guys see how much VC that I have right now. Now, um, if I wanted to, I could get more, but right now, I don't wanna get greedy, and I don't wanna get myself banned from NBA 2K21. Next gen comes out, a lot of people already have it, but if you're like me, I'm still waiting on my console to come in. It should actually come in today. Let me know if you guys secured a console or let me know if you guys are waiting on the PS5, but it doesn't matter. I'm still gonna post these bangers and you guys can still stack up your VC whether you're on current or next gen using these glitches because all your VC will, will carry over. And once we go get next gen, we're gonna go crazy. Surely there's VC glitches, badge glitches, and I'll be posting other content as well. Make sure boys drop a like, drop us up. Let's see if we can get this video to 100 likes. 30k JR is on the way. Join the ISO gang and check out my whole dribble tutorial if you guys want to dribble like a goat thank y'all boys so much for all support man it really means a lot and i'm gonna go ahead and get right into the video all right so with this vc glitch right here i'm gonna show you guys how to do this without the mod pack it's still extremely effective and before you guys know it you have 10k 20k even 30k vc even more depending on how much you grind so step number one is is you guys want to make a brand new player but you want to make the player extremely bad you guys want to make him short as possible um lowest wingspan lowest weight and make the badge spread extremely bad you guys already know the vibes the reason we're setting it up this way is this is going to allow us to get the most vc possible you guys want to make sure that you also skip their prelude and then you guys want to make sure that you guys go to a team that uh, will not make the playoffs. So a good example of that would be like the Cleveland Cavaliers, you can go to the Detroit Pistons, whatever the case may be. Now, once you guys do that, the very the next step you guys wanna do is sim to the end of the first season. And the reason why we wanna do this is once we sim out, we're able to renegotiate a contract and get even more VC. So yeah, man, if you guys wanna check out my mod pack video, I posted that y yesterday. It's a little bit of an investment, but it's totally worth it because a mod pack will do this glitch for you. But you can also do it manually. You guys just gotta make sure you guys start each game. So yeah, man, once the game, once the you have sim to the end of the season, you guys just wanna make sure you end the current season now once you guys do that uh, you guys can just spam a through all this stuff right here because it's not important now the next step is you guys want to select a, an NBA team and try to get the most VC possible now from what I have found so far the most VC I can get from a contract after the first se season is seven 85 so once you get here just make sure you guys hit enter free agency and then you guys want to pick any team and you guys want to try to get the most vc possible let me know if you guys are able to get more vc than 785 i've tried you know 950 even a thousand but like i said the most i'm ever able to get is 785 so you guys can pick any team and then you guys want to try and negotiate the best contract possible so to go to counter offer and then put your minutes all the way down and then put your teammate and yours down as well now for your vc um try to you know negotiate the best that you can really like i believe in this video i try to go for 800 but they would not accept 800. like i said 785 is the highest that i'm able have been able to get so far but i do believe if you go through a whole season whether you do it manual or with a mod pack once you get in your third season i think you can ask for even more vc but i'm not entirely sure so yeah man you guys will see that for this video right here I, I settled for 775 but i think 785 is the highest that you guys can go now um once you guys get through that you guys just want to go to your mob minutes tab and you guys will see that you currently have 10 minutes of playing time available you guys can start the glitch right now but i would advise you guys to do these next steps which will ensure you guys get through these my career games a whole lot faster which will also give you the most VC as fast as possible as well. So you guys wanna go ahead and play your first game. Now in this game, really all you guys wanna do is just get a F teammate grade. You guys can do that by getting a bunch of turnovers and then you guys can just foul out. That's key. 
make sure you guys you know get like a d minus or an f teammate grade because that's going to allow us to get less minutes played we got we want to get that 10 minutes per game down to five minutes which like i said is going to allow us to get through these games a whole lot faster now um so yeah man in this game you guys just want to play extremely bad don't do like any good stat walk out of bounds get turnovers and foul out and that will um get your teammate grade down to a f now um once you guys get your teammate grade down extremely bad you guys can just like i said you guys can foul out and then you guys can go ahead and let the game run now now for this first game that you guys are seeing right here you're not going to get any vc just because we fouled out which is fun like i said we're just setting up the glitch properly to where we're going to be able to get a lot of vc a lot faster if you guys take these steps and if you guys do this with the mod pack like i showed you guys in yesterday's video it's so op man I, I cannot lie you can let it run overnight and it will do everything for you but a lot of you guys might not want to invest in that so you guys can also do it do it manually so yeah um get a lot of fouls get a lot of turnovers and then foul out and yeah man you guys will get a really bad teammate grade you guys only have to do this for two games and then it will deduct your minutes all the way down to five i don't believe you're able to go get it get like the minutes under five you guys can check right here um this is after the first game you guys will see we're still at 10 minutes so the key is we want to get that down to five i don't think you can get it under five at all you guys can let me know if you get it down to one minute that would make this glitch even more op but unfortunately i don't think that's possible you guys let me know if you're able to get it under a minute that would be extremely dope so yeah man so this is the second game now in this second game like i said all you guys want to do is play extremely bad uh get turnovers make you know <laughs> force up really bad shots walk out of bounds and then all you guys want to do is foul out now uh once you foul out of this game right here you will go and just check your my minutes tab and you guys will see that it'll put you under five minutes and that's perfect once we get under five minutes we're able to get through these games extremely fast we get vc for doing absolutely nothing and that's what makes this vc glitch so op now um you guys can still do this on next gen as well because it is backwards compatible so you guys can play you know current or yeah current gen on um next gen consoles and still do these glitches just until i find new glitches on next gen so yeah man you won't get you won't get any vc for this game either just because we fouled out now uh, you guys can go to your mom minutes tab and you guys will see that it will put you at five minutes which is perfect that's exactly where we're gonna be and that's gonna allow us to get the most vc possible now before you play your next game go to your settings tab and put the quarter length on five minutes and then put the game difficulty on hall of fame just so we're able to get that hall of fame vc multiplier now what you guys want to do is go ahead and play your next game now in this game right here you literally don't have to do anything to be completely honest you guys can walk away from your con from your console for like five minutes and then you guys can come back and restart each game but in these games that go by extremely fast just because you know our minutes are so low and you know but you guys do want to make sure that you don't play well in these games or they will up your minutes so you guys can either stay at your console or you guys can you know go up watch a movie do your homework whatever the case may be you guys can literally spam this while you're doing homework and it's free vc that you guys can obtain just by doing this over and over again now like i said with the mod pack it does it for you so you guys don't even have to be at your console at all you can let it run overnight like me and you guys will really stack up your vc or you can do it manual like i said it's completely up to you but yeah man in this game i don't even feel like i played five minutes in this game i feel like i was only subbed in for like two or three minutes especially if you're able to get five fouls but you guys will see once this game is over with you will also you know get your vc so you guys will get 777 vc for doing absolutely nothing you guys can just spam this over and over again so yeah man super easy and super simple let me know if you guys have any questions thank y'all boys so much for all support drop a like drop a sub i'm out peace